Okay. Because he's down, he won't drop either. Ducks caught by the dude that's on the ground. Oh, does that hurt? Something cool. Four X movement range. Eh. Save. Okay. Yeah. 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 Thank you. Okay. See, now we've also got a twitch shot, which we can use. So we have to work out: do we want to get the the rush back, or is the twitch shot better? It was nice to get that guy, but I think this this hunter right here is the one that's like the key. I think we're just going to take out one of these guys. There's this one out here. Um, I just don't think we're going to separate those two. They don't seem to get far enough apart. Like that's as... I could need a lucky twitch shot, I think. Yeah, problem with even with a grenade, that leaves them on 18, both of them. Like, so we need someone to get a crit. And it's just, it's just not good. Kill and we get his um, charge Coming. back. We have that other guy we can pick off. I think there's two more we can pick off. Yeah, there's this one and there's the other guy. So it's really good if we can use this guy and then we've got those two and one more so we can get the cooldown back again for the boss fight. Dick 
Oh. Sleep it off. Cleanly done. Get your asses over off. here. Okay, so we still have a straggler over there, the tank, a pyro that's up higher, and the two hunters and the boss. So the issue is, can we, like, I don't think we can take these guys... Are they far enough apart here where if we take one out silently, the other one won't notice? Like it's really close. The pyro is not going to notice. He's too far away. Like they're outside of each other's um, sort of circle of influence there, though. I think she can get the shot from here. Well, maybe. I wonder if if the charge on that guy is is if Greymane is if Grey Wolf is so far away. crit chance though now is that because of that grey one's a little bit closer I'm going to see what happens with Dux's shot here the problem is the knockback is hey Wes how you doing man oh dude it's amazing absolutely amazing I'm going to try from her but I'm pretty sure the grey one is too close and um, the charge from Borman will... she'll see that. So we'd need to have a... I don't think we can do it from this position. I think she needs to be like way back in the, in the shed. So the only thing to find out then... we're gonna try. We're here. They both hit. What the crap? How did he... Get trapped, one of them! 
Nothing good. Yeah, so I think what we needed to do was, um... I think we can do this, though. Oh, because he had... Duck didn't have... That's where the distance was, because he has that half cover. Whereas we can move him... We move Duck. We need to get this the boar rush off first. Because that guy's got to go down. And then we've got to take it out before Greymane gets in. Yeah, Greymane's too far away. And then we need to have Duck in a position where he can get a shot off there without being spotted. I don't know if Selma can get here in time though, so that's a worry. <laughs> Not too shabby. So she's going to have to run. So he's only down for this turn. And she doesn't have bullets. So Duck's hitting for 7. We can force his fly. That means he's not getting a shot this turn. These two go 7-7-7. Seven, seven, seven. Okay, no, we're good, we're good. Duck can't back off because otherwise he can't shoot. Sorry about that. You finally figured out how to use that thing. Follow me. Okay. Am 
Right, so we've got the robot, the big guy, the pyro, the tank, and a straggler. We'll take out the straggler now. The other option is... We can't... Yeah, we can't get close enough to the pyro to guarantee the kill. Otherwise I'd use Duck's abilities and grab the crit. That had to hurt. Yeah, so that gives us gets us one kill closer to our abilities. Which should be her twitch shot, because she used her twitch shot on the first guy, then we killed him, then here. we killed the second guy, and then we just killed that guy. So her, her abilities are back. The boar rush... If I'd boar rushed... Did I boar rush second? I did. Nice. Okay. Because if I'd used ducks to kill that first guy and then done the boar rush we would have missed out on the cooldown but now we've got all our abilities back I don't think we can I think once they get to um, three armor they're not like they like he just he gets he headbutts him and then unless they were wearing unless the other one was wearing something yeah see at 26 and on high ground we can't take out pyro silently that's everybody else that's around though um That's glowing too, like we can interact with it. Something in there, though. Yeah, so I think we get this fight. Like, this fight seems like it's fairly... Four armor, though. Like, we're looking at 11 from... So that's only seven damage, seven, eight. All right, well that's that's decent, right? Like that's twenty-two means that Greymane gets one turn off, and then we go again. And if we use Twitch shots with the high ground, we probably just it's probably a one-turn kill. It'll be fourteen and fourteen, twenty-eight, and Duck can crit. Yeah, so there's a one-turn kill. And then we have to fight the pyro and the tank. Some kind of ancient machine. Whatever it was, it looks dangerous. Yeah, we'll need to do that to separate the incoming damage from the tank. Wait here. 
She gets extra high ground there, though. I don't know if that means anything. I hope it's something cool. Like there was something there. There's no cover if we go on this side, but I don't think we need it. trying to think of when the big guy comes through when the tank comes in we're probably going to want to be on this side hey can grab it now. Alright, stay here. <laughs> what does it mean when grey one enters that it's going to wake up and like start messing with us? Guy's dead on the toilet. <laughs> right. You're going to be from there. <clears throat> Borman from here. You reckon take her up even higher? So she's looking at 100% double crit, uh, which is going to deal uh, 22 damage. And he's looking at 7 damage or 14. And then Duck is looking at... Oh yeah, we're going loud. Eight. On top of the 2230. Okay, so... Yeah, okay, she's definitely twitch-shotting. 
with the Boomstick 3. What happened with the first... Why didn't it twitch shot? I was set to twitch shot, right? that happened before and I the first time I thought it was my fault but that time I was pretty sure it was on twitch shot it might not have been because I had been bouncing them around a bit okay we're definitely on twitch shot with the boomstick and there's a 100% chance to hit both both to crit right oh wait that's not the boomstick there we go. 100%, 100%. Okay. That's Twitch shot. She's already taken fire damage, right? Because I just did two lots of... Were they 15 on the crits? 11... Oh, she was 38. So she hasn't taken the fire damage. Yeah, the two fire damage, though, doesn't um, stack. It, it, well, it stacks number of turns that you're on fire for, not the amount of fire damage you take. No, so she was... She was fif doing two 15 damage shots which have four armor so it's 11 and 11 and chief gray one was on 38 so we've done the 22 fire what is the fire damage is it it's only one though isn't it So that's going to hit for 8. Armor reducing fire damage. Unless that's just us though. So it comes down to whether we do we use this as a normal shot. <laughs> Plus it crits, which is great cuz it means Borman doesn't have to use cooldown. So the issue is if the pyro can hit from here. Yeah, I'm thinking about that. That does mean that gives him line of sight up here. Whereas I don't think he's... If he runs up, I think we can just overwatch him. 
We're not gonna be we're not killing him. No, he means he can shoot up on his turn. Although he's probably gonna be able to shoot up on his turn anyway, right? And we're gonna get a crit if we hit it. We're gonna get a crit, that's the most important thing. Because of her height. Damn, I'm good. 